Cause I'm too outstanding Cause the girls in the hood are always hard Ever since 16 I've been You're not in the frame job, know. Nothing You're down life, But I, I gotta get rich You can check the throw back Picks up in that bitch I'm a hot girl I do Here it is Aww. Hey Well I gotta play in this song <laughs> It's a birthday Just play it one time for the bridge Matching Hey guys, part two of Holly and Tia's birthday adventures. We are at They're playing golf. gonna do a review I don't know what video I'm gonna put this in but I'm trying Panera's new broccoli and cheddar mac and cheese I am lactose intolerant it's okay though. it's a little hot I'm gonna say that this is a solid I'm just gonna add some salt and pepper to it I think I'll be good I have my soup. There's this cute boy over there. Uh, here you go. Oh, no. When do we even get up? Okay, guys. So, it's day two, or attempt two, of surprising my friends for their birthday. Um, once again, just to be clear, I do hate every other Scorpio. Don't get it confused. I only like about three of them. So, by the way, my Harley Quinn tattoo will not come off. So, Holly's birthday was yesterday. And now we did the surprise in Top Golf and Balawa. And now we're setting up for Tia's surprise. So, look at that. So today is my friend T's birthday. Uh, we surprised her and everything last night. Um, she has never had a good birthday before. So, and she's turning 19 today. So, we did something nice for her because I've had all good birthdays. And I just can't believe that you can have a bad birthday. So, I know you see that the lid's not laid. Uh, I'm doing get ready with me, basically, on top of this. Because we're going out and getting cute and going out and doing festivities. So... I'm just going to be talking about my life and uh, having a little girl talk and girl chat with you. <laughs> Story time. So, once upon a time, I started talking to a guy. And I've talked to a couple of guys in my life. And almost all of them have gone to shit. And they've been really mean to me. Or, like, I just... No, most of them have just been mean. If my... Well, not any, but... A video a while back, a guy ghosted me and made me want to slack on my YouTube a lot because it was really hurting my feelings because he came to me. And it seems like, this is what I'm going to talk about, how when guys come to you, they seem to never fail to play you. Like, I had no clue who this guy was in August. He was a year older than us. 
I did not know him at all. He went to a different high school than me. And some predicaments are just going to be avoidable. And I think that if you can avoid a situation, you should always choose to avoid the situation rather than fuel it. And I think something that I'm learning now, guys, is like, first of all, just because someone else doesn't see your worth doesn't mean that your worth isn't there. Basically, for a while, um, every time, like, a guy would stop talking to me or just be mean to me and, like, make me feel like I was the problem when I was not. Um, I mean, fuck them. Last night, my skin was breaking out, but I guess that it's okay now. But, uh, like I was saying, boys hurt feelings. Fuck them. If you're a guy watching this video and you have pretended to want to be in a relationship with a girl just to have sex with her, then you know the girl wouldn't have sex with you if y'all were not in a relationship. So you only try and get her in a relationship for that reason, you are the problem, you are a creep, you are a weirdo, and you deserve to get your ass beat. So, well guys, keep in mind that I, you know, this guy, I thought that he actually liked me because he was really putting on a show. Like, congratulations, motherfucking relations. Guys, it's 11-11, I'm putting on this. But I, and my wishes, I wish for happiness and uh, for abundance and love and honestly money and honestly fame and honestly success. That's what I wish for. And that's what I'm going to have and that's what I am. I'm famous. I'm beautiful. I am happy. I am successful. I am a lover. I am a family person. Um. My hair is like old curls. I think it's kind of obvious or like you can tell, but I kind of like it. Okay. The funny thing about me is that something that I find really like funny is that last year I hated jewelry. Or like I just, I probably didn't hate jewelry. I probably just couldn't afford jewelry to be honest with you because I didn't have a job or anything. I'm at lunch with Tia. Yeah, thank you. It's really bright. We're going to go to a museum and it's going to be so fun. How you doing? Good. I feel like I know you. We're at the museum. Nice. Nice. Cute. Okay, so Alexis, somehow she accumulated the funds to get us all to bowl. It's I don't know. It's like this. Who wants to be we on definitely, She rented us out the whole bowl. I, I yes, I'm sorry. I'm the new Oprah. I'm taking over. Look at that. Hey, wait. You have to stand like this. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> Holly, what face did you make? What? What face did you make? What face do they make? Yeah, for your pictures. I went. Oh, nice. Hey, guys. <laughs> Oh my god, we should be like the notebook. Oh, yeah. Where we lay in the street and watch the. We were not <laughs> Me and Holly are laying in the middle of the street right now. Here's something. I'm gonna paint her a car. Oh my god. A Tesla. 
I'm gonna paint you one too, Holly. I'm decorating. Holly's birthday was yesterday, and we did something, but you guys would have already seen that by now. 